Love Games is a part of the Safe Love Campaign, brought to you by the Ministry of Health and National AIDS Council, with support from the United States Agency for International Development and its Communication Support for Health Project through the U.S. President's Emergency Plan for AIDS Relief. So, how are things? Fine, I guess. School. Oh, I have a job now. 
Oh, really? Mm-hmm. I work for an advertising agency. It's called Creative Minds. Oh, great. I've heard a lot of good things about Creative Minds. <laughs> so, Mom, where is Dad? Oh, your dad is working. Oh. Again. But this time he's in Chisamba. Oh. And unfortunately, baby, you can't see him until tomorrow. Oh. <laughs> well, anyways, how are things going with you? So, so. Can't complain. How's your wife? She's fine. We're just not together at the moment. But uh, she's fine. Really? Divorce? No, we're just not together at the moment. Um, <laughs> she just needs some space. I'm sorry. I don't mean to laugh. Why haven't you called me all this time? Now we changed, man. to matchmake me, especially not with Thomas Kazela Jr. Why? I know what I want. I want something special, you know? I want to look into the eyes of my man and know that I am the only one he sees, mm -hmm. thinks, wow. and dreams about. <laughs> I want to get married to a man, not a name. Yeah. Well, I'll marry my man. Ooh, <laughs> this is nice. Look at you. Oh, yes. Let me go home, man. I've already put the Vitengis in the car. <laughs> yeah, I'll be there soon. Good afternoon, Mr. Chinkwemba. Good afternoon, Mwamba. I'm going to need this by Wednesday. Wednesday? Yeah. Consider it done. Remember, this is the case that could see your name on sign outside. <laughs> I know. Thank you. I'll see you Monday. All right. For the wedding night, sensual oh, oh, oh. healing. <laughs> thank you, thank you. This is also for you. Scented condoms. <laughs> Tasheri. You've been away for too long, Mama, in that Europe of yours. Mm. Welcome to Zambia. <laughs> Here, if you even try talking about using condoms in a marriage, it brings up all sorts of issues. It just comes out like you just don't trust him. Mm. But what if you don't trust him? <laughs> How do I get married if you don't trust your husband? <laughs> what the? Farida. Where's my money, Beyonce? I've been trying to call you and your phone's been off. What's wrong with you? Uh, you know how it is. Work, school. I was actually just about to call you. But you didn't. Listen, Farida, I'll have your money soon. Soon? How soon? You know I'm sick. I have measles. What? Measles? <coughs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean to laugh. But you think this is funny, huh? You think I like looking like this? Seriously, I need the money for the Brazilian, Mimi. I'm running a business here, so get serious, Mimi. Listen, Farida, I will have your money by tomorrow. You're playing with me, huh? If I don't have my money by tomorrow, I will come there and I will give you these measles. So you better have my money tomorrow, no, Mimi. No, I'll, I'll have your money. 
I'll have your money by tomorrow, I promise. Okay, bye. Hello? Hi, David. So, are we getting naughty tonight? problems with condoms. It's just that I don't think they can work in a marriage, especially with a Sunday man. No, but I mean, if you're trying to protect yourself, or if you want to use them for birth control, or if you don't know your partner's status. <laughs> Have you and Charlie been tested, by the way? No, but we will go. <laughs> well then, I guess it's more about the marriage if both partners are faithful to each other. Or if they're not being faithful, they should at least use condoms with their other partners. So then it's okay to use condoms. But when you're getting married, you say your vows. And your vows include staying faithful to your partner, right? But if people stick to their vows, we wouldn't have such a big problem with HIV in Zambia. That is so true. But then again, we are dealing with human beings, so mistakes do happen. You don't know if you are the only one in his or her sex life, so no condom, no sex. Easy. <laughs> As for me, <laughs> no condoms. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> It's not my kind of place, but uh, you look great. Relax, David. Like, this is a club. No one will bother you here. And besides, half the people you see are drunk. Waiter, I want a tequila. Ah, we need to get this party started. <laughs> If you performance but how can he be like my first child? He's supposed to be the father of my first child. It means that you should take care of him. Is he not supposed to take care of me? Iwe. Iwe mukashingo le sunga we baba we munga ndabwino. Aka kusunga bwino na iwe. Epe. Okay no mba ngefi chabe ifi. Ni shinde ofa bana mayo bana ilishanya sana. Women are always complaining about how their husbands are cheating on them, beating them bale ba puma sana and just generally mistreating them. No. I don't agree with you. You have it all wrong. There was even a Maya about it that complain. I'll give you an example of my husband. My husband is a very good man and very hardworking. He works very hard to take care of his family. So there was even a Maya about it that complain. I don't agree. Okay, and Tamara, if you're from Walanda, but the question is, does he take care of you? Mufakar, mind. Marriage is not a bed of roses. You must learn to tolerate each other. Ufuile wa kosa, ule ufu. Pantu mweba ntuwa bilinga mwa upano. There has to be mutual respect for each other. You have to be faithful to each other. Ilo mufuile mle yesu nga na mwini. Icho chena, enkama fea bapa chupu. Mwimba ya Afrika, so mwimbeko. Mwimbeko. Super pine to law. She wanted to eat my man. Oh, man, as a very poor hours, a lukumbo, a time, money, but you are tight on if it tumbo, a man, as a very poor hours, a lukumbo, a time, money, but you are tight on if it tumbo, a lot of some pull up, it tumbo, a lot of young pata, 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 it tum
you have dialed is not reachable. <sighs> David, where are you? David or no David, this event is going on, okay? But he said he'd be here. Look, he's provided the you venue. Know? We're going ahead with this. You see, what's important is that you have made a decision. That's all. So why do I feel this nervous, <laughs> man? It's you know? normal, man. It's normal. <sighs> but just relax. Right. You know, when these people come in, you just relax, sit there, let everything... We, I'm going to explain everything to you, okay? okay? Let the ladies, my wife and them, we'll, we'll receive them and everything. But okay. it's just you and... Hello, guys. Charity! How are you doing? So glad you could make it. I wouldn't have missed this. <laughs> Charlie, congratulations. Thank you. It's good to see you. Good to see you too. Thank you all for coming. You're welcome. And this is Chilufia, my best friend since high school. Hello, Chilufia, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Nice meeting you, Chilufia. My pleasure. This is David's wife, the one of the house. Okay. And by the way, yes. where is David? Um, he's just doing some errands here and there. I think he should be joining us pretty soon. Um, he's just held up. He's uh, just doing one or two things. Yes. Mm. Well, we will leave you men to eat. Yes. Let us welcome the in-laws. That was great. Mm. What's the time? It's 14 hours. 14? It's not bad, considering we got here at five. Oh, I slept way gosh. after six. Let me guess, we have to go. Yeah, it's Charlie's matter to today. And so? They must be wondering where I am, eh? I'm sure they can take care of themselves. Uh, my wife will be there. Those women come in, eh? you don't say a thing, okay? okay. I do the talking, or you do it just normal, okay? Just relax, just feel free, because yeah? they'll come and they'll be all over here and they'll be showing you the food. Okay, just relax. Feel free, don't panic, okay? Ah, ew. Where have you been? Have I missed anything? Your wife was asking about you. Huh? Uh -uh, no, really. Where have you been? Ah. Who is that lady with the camera? I don't know. I think Carol's relative. I think. Are you sure you're marrying the right girl? <laughs> <laughs> Never mind her though. Who? Sister? Oh, that's Womba. A friend to Carol's Auntie Tamara. She is beautiful. <laughs> the young man is into older women. Age <laughs> ain't nothing but a number. And your night go away. Hi, Mama. Check tomorrow's today. So, what's the story? Uh, tomorrow. What do you want? Dollar? Squatcher? <laughs> hmm. Mimi keeps her word. I'm impressed. I wouldn't be too surprised if I were you. You'd be seeing a lot more of this. Trust. Where did all this money come from? I bumped into one of my former ministers of finance. Looks like he's been reinstated. <laughs> With immediate effect. <laughs> <laughs>
heaven must be missing an angel. And hell just sent over a little devil. Hi, I'm Mimi. Nice to meet you. Tajani Chanda, same here. So, Mimi, she's uh, one of our leading copywriters and a very talented young lady. <laughs> so, I'll leave you the camera behind of Mimi. Okay, and welcome aboard. Baby. For more information on any of the issues in Love Games, visit the website, text the short code, or call the number on your screen now. Love Games is a part of the Safe Love Campaign, brought to you by the Ministry of Health and National AIDS Council, with support from the United States Agency for International Development and its Communication Support for Health Project through the U.S. President's Emergency Plan for AIDS Relief. Love Games. Love Games. It's the